Happy, happy Friday, all my fellow brothers and sisters and doll. It's me, your buddy Donnie again, with another doll review. And as always, telling it like a T.I.E. is. Um, I am... Um, I, this isn't really an unboxing because, <laughs> because, um, usually an, un when I, okay, when I do an unboxing for the most part is because I have an extra doll at hand, you know, so, uh, I, you know, I can do that. But in this case, uh, I don't have an extra doll. Uh, what this is, it's not quite an unboxing. What it is, is more of a show and tell, but let's start. Um, yeah, normally this would be an unboxing of, uh, Jules Secrets with me. You know, that's what this video, you know, seems, but not exactly. I don't have, um, a, a spare, um, Jules Secrets with me, you know, that I could, um, like I said, you know, spare to do the unboxing of. This is, um, from a time when boxes were glued shut, Okay. So I, I can't, you know, open it and close it, you know, so easily. But anyways, I'll show you because, oh, uh, look at this artwork. See, the Jewel Secrets line of Barbie, Whitney, Ken, Skipper, and, um, is the last, um, <clears throat> excuse me, the last uh, line of dolls that featured this stunning artwork. Oh, my goodness. But anyways... Uh, this isn't so much about the Jewel Secrets Whitney, you know, um, factory issued by Mattel. It's not so much about her. What, what this video is really about, it's about a custom that I made, okay, which is a black version, okay, of Jewel Secrets Whitney, okay? Um, if you're familiar with the Jewel Secrets line, you'll remember that there was White Barbie, Black Barbie, White Whitney, and White Skipper, Barbie's little sister. But um, you may also be aware that Mattel issued a Black Barbie and a Black Ken, but there was no Black Skipper and no Black Whitney, okay? Now, I happen to be a huge fan of the Whitney head mold. I mean, the, they call it the Steffi head mold, okay? Um, those beautiful whispering lips, they work great, okay, on, on, on dolls of any ethnicity, okay, and, um, I have the black, uh, Jewel Secrets Barbie, I have the black Jewel Secrets Ken, um, but I decided, you know, to make me a black version of Jewel Secrets Whitney, you know, so here she is, um, now this custom, it's I, I it, it's a two part thing because um, while I was thrifting I found you know a Jewel Secrets um, uh, a Whitney with pretty much her complete outfit she had on the earrings you know her, the the ring on her finger you know her dress her jacket you know her belt and her crown but Sister Girl had no shoes on you know her hair was an excellent shape, you know, they just put in a bag. And because I had that one, I I, I decided to um, make this custom, okay? Um, so this custom was, uh, all I had to do was a reroute. A reroute of, um, this is really a golden dream uh, Christy, okay? It's a golden dream Christy, as you can see. Um, I rerouted her, okay, um, emulating the white uh, a version, okay, uh, of Jewel Secrets Whitney, uh, but because I like, when I do a reroute, I really like my show to work, I mean to show, my, my, my work <laughs> to show, so I rerouted her with much longer, okay, than the factory doll did. I was doing Totally Hair Barbie length before Totally Hair even existed. Okay, as you can see, I uh, did her in mostly a solid brown, okay, a solid, rich, dark brown, but I I also rooted her with, uh, did I do one or two rows? No, one row. With one row in this uh, coppery, orangey tone, one, um, just one row, 
around the perimeter of her head, okay, for fun, for highlights, okay, um, so she has this, this two-tone look, you know, and again, I was just emulating, you know, the, the, the white uh, doll's um, hair color scheme, you know, uh, the white doll, um, she also has a very similar tone of dark brown, and she has also one row of contrasting hair, okay, but her one row of contrasting hair is just a lighter shade of brown, okay, just, a, you know, and it's, and it's beautiful, but as you can see, you know, her hair is not that, it's long, but it's not as long as mine, you know, I made my girl, you know, with longer hair. Anyways, um, again, I was lucky, you know, so I just dressed her, you know, the only thing is that I, because I didn't have the shoes, I decided to give her these very similar, you know, um, to the, the, the factory ones, except they're blue, but these are generic, these are generic, no brand, they might be Totsy, you know, they might be Shillman, I'm not sure. They're generic, but, you know, they're very similar, you know, to the style of shoes that um, the Whitney came with, which is um, strapless mules, okay? So, you know, she's just wearing these. Maybe one day I'll, you know, find better shoes, but but I, I like these white shoes. They're, they go with everything, you know? Um, I'm very proud of this little lady. I love her very much. Um, because, because, okay, um, again, she's a custom that Mattel never made, you know, and I wondered, okay, well, they made Black Barbie, they made the, the Black Ken, why didn't they make the Black Whitney and, 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 and the Black Skipper, you know, uh, I don't mean to make this about race, you know, I don't mean to, you know, but, but, you know, it's just a legitimate question that I, that I ask myself, you know, it's like, okay, why not, you know? Um, but, see, this is part of the fun of doll customizing, you know? When you don't see something that you wish existed, you know, on store shelves, well, you make your own. You make your own, you know? So, here is Miss Jewel Her, I mean, Miss Jewel Secrets Whitney, you know, a black version, okay? Um, she is absolutely gorgeous. Like I said, she's really a, a golden dream, uh, Christy, that I rerouted. Um, I rerouted her with a fiber that I don't, I, I don't know if it's Canecalon, okay, or Toyocalon, I'm not sure, because the, the packages that, um, that I got this hair from, it simply said synthetic hair. That's it, synthetic braid. It didn't specify if it was Toyocalon or Canecalon, you know. I know it's not nylon, you know, but but again, it's it's a fiber that obviously I like, I like working with, you know, and that's how I did my reroute. So again, I did her with Beauty Supply Her. And um, anyways, I believe I have taken enough of your time, my dear brothers and sisters and doll. But, 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 before I leave, I'd like to give you a sneak peek. Uh, recently, um, Mattel, I think it was last year, came out with uh, Tina Turner Barbie, which, by the way, I do not care for. I don't like it. I hated it. <laughs> but So I decided to make my own. But I'm going to make my own using this um, Christie. The, the outfit you recognize is from Barbie and the Beat Christie, okay? Um, but this is not a Barbie and the Beat Christie, okay? Because again, someone um, just you know dressed her with this outfit, but but this is not. But this is the doll I will use to make my own version of my Barbie loves Tina Turner. Okay, so this is the doll I'm gonna use, and this is the hair that I'm gonna use to reroute her completely. Okay, I think it looks a stunning contrast against her skin. And uh, my good friend Michael, Michael Campbell, is going to make me the replica little outfit. You know, I'm going to go with the outfit, the little red dress that she wore in the typical male um, video of Tina Turner. Okay, so it's just a little sneak peek of what's coming. Okay, so anyways, thank you all for watching, you know, my uh, humble little videos. 
I love you all, my fellow brothers and sisters and all. And again, I cannot thank you enough, okay, for the warmth of your company, okay, the warmth of your... Yeah, because that's what you are, you know, your company, you know. I make these videos, and I enjoy watching the videos that I watch because, you know, it's... Uh, um, I feel like I have a friend over, okay? I really do. It, 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 that, that's... It's a virtual visit. Anyways, I love you guys. Have a wonderful Friday, rest of the weekend. And uh, if you like, you know, please hit the subscribe button, like, and share. Okay? Again, for the love of dolls. <laughs> I love you all. Bye-bye for now.